Hello everybody and welcome back to another Call of Duty video. Last time we had, um, you know, just, just a little bit of a quick little game, maybe two games of Call of Duty. And today we're joined by Beach Top Stuff, just like in the last Hi. episode. Hi. So yeah, today we're... Just a quick little break real quick. If you want to see me or Matthew stream, guys, just go into your app store, type in Omelette Arcade, download the app, open the app store, and it'll take you here once you've created an account. You can now watch other people stream. You can stream yourself. You can watch me stream. I am Blue Light 31 There's all the people I follow. Uh, this is the shop, and they have a shop where you can send emojis and stuff in chat. Here I am, I am Blue Light 31 And yeah, it's just an overall good streaming service, so if you want to get that, you can watch me stream. Testing out the Meteor Gun. So, I've used this a lot more than Carter. I'm more experienced with it. This is actually my favorite gun, I would say. Other than the, other than the pistol, other than that, because the pistol is my favorite. <laughs> Yeah, sorry if you can hear that little uh, squeak thing every time you hear me talk, because that's just the call buzzing. Okay, let's go. We're gonna practice against AI because, you know, we suck. Carter thinks it's underpowered. Yeah, I know, because I never used it. I have these hands. It'll let you rejoin. Oh no. I got a kill? Okay, this thing is actually pretty good. I told you. It's pretty much a second kill. Carter be like... If you hit some- if you hit a couple headshots with it, it's pretty OP. Okay, I'm joining back in. If you have at least decent accuracy for this game, you're pretty much set for kills with this gun. It's not meant to be used for, like, out-of-range kills, like... Yeah, are, this like, is definitely a close-up kill gun. Like, I've already got my turret because of this. It's really OP. I have two kills. Also, use gravity spikes. It's good. You can easily get a few kill streaks with this. Okay, yeah. I'm using... I've deployed my stealth chopper twice using this thing. Ooh, I can use the nuclear bomb? <gasps> nuclear bomb, question mark? <sighs> yes. Please don't. I used it. Ooh, just got two sparrow kills. I used the nuclear bomb. Ooh, there it was. Let's go. Like the most predator kills I could have ever gotten. I got a nuke kill. I thought the game would be over if you got yeah, the Yeah, me too. Yeah, you got the final kill. I honestly thought the nuke would be the final kill, but you're invincible for a few seconds in this mode. Also, neither of us died once, I'm pretty sure. So, what, what would you rate it out of five stars? Out of five stars? Or ten, so we can have half. Uh, I'd rate it definitely a three and a half out of five. Okay, so that's 5 out of 10 then. I would say it's more out of a 7 out of 10 for me because it's it's more for my play style, which is um, to get up close and personal with people. Of course, I don't really like to use shotguns because they're pretty slow and can actually get you killed sometimes. Yeah. And it has a pretty fast reload anyway, so... I think the next episode will be reviewing the Evil Clown since I just got that, and when Matthew will get it, we can review it. Do you have it? M16 Evil Clown? Um... What was it called again? M16 Evil Clown? Uh... M I have the M16 Hellion. Basically, it's just an M16 reskin. It doesn't really do much or anything else. Yeah, anymore. we'll just we'll uh yeah, we'll just do the M16 next round. But I have a skin for it, so. Okay. Well, we'll see you guys next episode. Bye. We'll see.